A claim for personal injuries has been filed against the city of Bakersfield by two Bakersfield College students who were detained by Bakersfield police officers on December 6th of 2016. In a video posted on the NAACP Bakersfield Facebook page, former CSU Bakersfield students Timothy Grismore and Xavier Hines talked about their experience leading to their arrest. At first we were kind of scared and confused. We were still shocked in some type of way, you know, just because it, it didn't it seem surreal, honestly, the way the whole moment, the whole night happened in the situation. Um, right now, we're feeling a little bit more happy, you know, we uh, we're got through our, our charges were dropped and stuff like that, so, you know, we're feeling better, but uh, we still feel, you know, paranoid at certain times, you know, I mean, it's daily things we can't do anymore. Grismore and Hines said they were taking a break from studying for finals to get Taco Bell when the officer stopped them, attacked them, and arrested them near the 1100 block of Valhalla Drive. Both students and representatives attended a city council meeting on Wednesday, January 26, where they spoke about their incident and how concerned they are about the officer still on duty. Grismore and Hines said because of this incident, they aren't able to do certain things they used to do on a daily basis. It was very, it was traumatizing. Like you said, it's a lot of stuff that we used to do on a daily basis we don't do anymore because of that situation. And, uh, yeah, we're just trying to keep our heads up right now. Uh, positive. Bakersfield citizen and Reverend Ralph Anthony said he hopes the city council will look at this as a problem for everyone. For it to take place uh, is not human to continue to take place. To correct it is uh, real human. And... Uh, it will make sense for an intelligent people that want to develop a community that Bakersfield can be and, and has been and will be. As this case continues with both Grismore and Hines, the representatives call for action against the officers. For Runner News Network, I'm Julie Manai.